We are back at Omain Studios in the 207 Kitchen, and I am here with Lynn Archer from Archers on the Pier, and you know when she is in the 207 Kitchen that we are gonna cook something simple and tasty, and today we're using fresh Maine seafood. What are we making? So today we're gonna make oven fried haddock, mm. and it's very crispy, and it's very simple, and it's not a lot of steps as usual, but the best part about it is, you know, we support our main fishermen mm. and we use local ingredients. And so we're starting with a half a stick of melted butter. All right. And then we're going to take about a pound and a half of haddock or cod. Cod works e equally as well. A nice white fish like that. And you put it in kind of a serving size. Um, I'm a lover of Ritz crackers. I know you are. Well, I like the buttery flavor. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you can always use a whole stick of butter, or you can use right. a half a stick of Ritz crackers and crunch it up. There you go. And then I use about a tablespoon of garlic. Okay. And I like this minced garlic. It works good. And about a half a cup of panko. And I like the seasoned stuff, um, but that's what gives it nice crunchy, yeah. crunchy flavor. And the other thing I like about this recipe is I love that lemony citrus. So you actually use the zest oh. off your lemon. Interesting. And Get a little something extra. Oh, well, it makes it bright. Yes. Yep. It makes it really, really bright. And then, how's the butter coming? Oh, it's coming. Perfect. It's the juice of a half of a lemon. A little salt and pepper. And that looks like that's pretty, pretty close. And you pour your melted butter right over the top. Mix it together. And then you just put it right on top of your fish. Simple as that. Simple as that. And do you have to put anything on the fish? No. No, 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 no. You've already got everything you need. Okay. Because it just, um, too much is too much with fish. You want that flavor to come through. Yep. And then, just a little dry white wine. Of course, you can see that's not a whole bottle. It went somewhere before <laughs> it got here. A little white wine, just around the edges like that. And what does that do? Well, it kind of steams the fish a bit. Okay. You put it in a nice hot oven, about 400 degrees, 15 minutes. And what I do alongside of that at the very same time is I take some fresh asparagus, and I roast it at the same time, takes the same amount of time with a little olive oil oh. and roll it around a little bit. And again, a little salt and pepper. Put them both in the oven, 400, 15 minutes. Perfect. And you end up with a beautiful, beautiful meal. So we'll... Um, Put this in the oven. And when you get done, it's Ooh. going to come out looking like that. That looks so good. Because it's the crunch. It's that the you crunch. Really want mm -hmm. with this Without dish. frying. Right. So to avoid the frying. Right. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks so much. You're for welcome. Showing us how to make this. If you want to make this yourself, just head to the 207 section of our website or app and stay with us. 207 is back right after this.